Hi, I'm Ben Benton, here with Mike, and uh, we're here today to tell you about our newest addition to our metal fabricating plant. We're, uh, we've got us a trunk 6,000 watt CO2 laser. Uh, bed size is 80 by 240. Um, it's one of three that we know of that's on the East Coast. And um, we've uh, had a little help. Uh, we've got bb &T here, Neil Benton. Uh, Colonel Anderson is also here today with us. Uh, my father started this company about, say about 20 years ago. Um, he's not here today, but he's been instrumental in uh, providing us with everything we need to, to do a good job and uh, to work with the local companies. So I guess we can show it to you. The capabilities of this machine are three-quarters stainless. We can cut up to three-quarters stainless and one-inch carbon steel. Uh, it's much faster than, than any of the other types of uh, cutting, such as plasma, water jetting, or older technology in lasers. Uh, we make all types of parts. We make parts for the construction industry. We make parts for uh, industrial uh, pro produce uh, manufacturers uh, such as Mount Olive Pickle, uh, APV Heat. We do a lot of work for these folks. Uh, I don't want to leave anybody out, but, uh, but they are two pretty big customers of us right here local. We also do some work up in Raleigh uh, for companies up in Raleigh and uh, a lot of our products go worldwide so we build machinery and this is just a great uh, addition to, to, our, to our job shop. Uh, start off with we'll get an order or a DXF file or AutoCAD drawn in the office I have two programmers up there that I sent to Connecticut for a week training. They'll take and program it. Um, it uh, their computers up front in the office are tied to this machine. Um, they transfer the information to the machine. Uh, we load the sheet down on the loading table. Uh, they pull up their program. Uh, bring it up and they just hit and go and uh, she starts cutting. Uh, they do have some maintenance and some lens, uh, some things that they have to do every morning. Uh, but other than that, it's a pretty trouble-free system. I'm an example of when the boss is not around. We get things like this, deer heads, snowflakes, Christmas ornaments, also out of the machine. But this is a very fine piece that they've made here. Um, the machine is uh, almost maintenance free. It uh, lubes itself every eight hours. It's got a set pattern that the, that the movable parts uh, move to and it basically pumps grease and oils itself. I think we have, a, we have to have it checked or maintained twice a year uh, provided there's no problems or, or any break. Ben, that is an incredible machine that you have there, and I know that uh, last year you had been extremely busy in your production, uh, and you added employees last year. Can you mention something about that? Um, yeah, the the machine that we're uh, that we're running back here to Trump, it's uh, it's sp sped my productivity up by probably I would say two thirds. Um, uh, this past year we had a, a lot of work the last quarter and uh, we would never have been able to do it or add on the employees that we have added uh, if it wa wasn't for this machine and the technology that goes along with it. Mount Olive Pickle, uh, one of Wayne County's own, uh, utilizes you. Did uh, they use any of their uh, pieces on this? Uh, yes, sir. I would say 
Uh, the majority of the thicker metal, the, the uh, quarter inch and three eighths and, and that they use, uh, we've cut on this machine, a lot of large sheets as well. Um, yeah. We were talking about the differential advantage and you mentioned that uh, there's only three of these on the uh, East Coast and the size of the pieces that uh, you put on it are just huge. I mean, and the size of that bed again is what? 80 inches by 240, which is basically 20 feet long by about six feet wide. Oh my goodness, that, so. is, that is huge. Uh, and I imagine with the size uh, and the capabilities of the size and the speed definitely gives you a differential advantage when it comes to our local industries utilizing your services. It does. I can, uh, I can handle their requests quicker, uh, cheaper, with uh, a better quality. Yeah, that, that's a, I think that's an important piece too, and that with the speed, you have a better efficiency and therefore the cost per unit goes down. Right, yes sir. Uh, that and the precision, uh, you don't have to do it twice. Uh, you cut it one time and, and you're good. Uh, you've got good parts. And say it's just a matter of uh, keeping the work to it and uh, keeping the programmers here long enough to keep it busy, you know? Well, most of those guys are family, aren't they? Uh, one of them is and the other one might as well be. <laughs> Well, that's great. Then that was a very impressive display that that uh, piece of machinery can do. And um, we had Neil Benton with BBT out here today taking a look at it and Commissioner Amy Anderson. And we're all amazed with the capabilities of that machine. Well, thank you. Uh, Say so it uh, took us a long time to get here, a lot of years. and. Uh, We've got a lot of loyal customers, and uh, like I say, if it wasn't for them, uh, we wouldn't be where we're at doing what we're doing. So. And that's in addition to some of your other machinery, and uh, we were talking a minute ago, you still have your water jet, and that will cut through how thick? Uh, up to five inches thick, uh, but it takes a lot longer than the laser. And you do have another laser uh, out on the uh, shop floor also, don't you? Yes, sir. We primarily use that one now to cut small drops, uh, odds and ends. We also cut angle and tubing with it as well. I think it's very impressive that uh, with this new technology, uh, and this is definitely going to give you the differential advantage as far as uh, bidding products going forward and we really appreciate it from uh, Wayne County Development Alliance and Wayne County Commissioners that you all making this investment in this piece of uh, equipment. Well, as this economy comes back, we're going to be ready for it. That's right. Thank you so much. Thank you.